Hey, Two Rivers family, so glad you're here uh, tuning in uh, to this uh, brief message from, from me to you. This coming Friday, I, I want to encourage you to gather your uh, family, your friends, uh, people that are close to you, and do communion together. Uh, you know, Scripture says that you are a royal priesthood. Uh, so I believe that you can lead your communion, time of communion, there in your very own home in the company of your family and friends. Uh, what you may want to do is go to the store and, and get either a loaf of bread or some crackers, get some grape juice or something to, to that effect, and, and have this moment at your home. Uh, what you may want to do is, what I'd like you to do is that maybe if most of us in the church family could do that at seven in our homes uh, with those that are close to us, uh, that would be great. Uh, just considering that it's Good Friday. A passage you might want to read is Mark chapter 14, which reads like this. I'm sorry, Mark chapter uh, yeah, 14, verse uh, 23. As they were eating, Jesus took some bread and blessed it. Then he broke it into pieces and gave it to the disciples, saying, Take it, for this is my body. And he took up a cup of wine and gave thanks to God for it. He gave it to them, and they all drank from it. And he said to them, This is my blood, which confirms the covenant between God and his people. It is poured out as a sacrifice for many. I tell you the truth, I will not drink wine again until the day I drink it new in the kingdom of God. Then they sang a hymn and went out to the Mount of Olives. So I want to encourage you this uh, Good Friday to do something meaningful with your family. If you like, you could also take a picture of those that are there with you and post them on Facebook or on TRBC Connections, uh, hashtag TRBC Family. Um, and uh, and that's, uh, that's my encouragement to you guys this uh, coming Friday. Uh, let me pray for us and then I'll let you go. Lord Jesus, thank you so much for this time. Thank you for this season that we call Easter or Resurrection Sunday, Lord, coming up. Uh, we thank you for friends and family and Above all, we thank you, Jesus, that you were raised from the dead and therefore we can have life and can have freedom from the mastery and slavery of sin and the power of it. Thank you, Christ our King. We love you. It's in your name we pray. And all of God's people here on site and online together with one voice said, Amen.